The county sheriff, Joe Baker, now defending how his office is spending your taxpayer money. CBS 17 obtained internal memos filled with concerns from county leaders. Now, Sheriff Baker put together a report of more than 100 pages outlining why he did what he did. CBS 17's Michael Hyland sat down with him today. Michael, how did he explain it to you? Right, when I talked to him here at his office, he didn't deny that any of these things happened that the county leaders pointed out, but he also didn't apologize for some of these decisions that he's made. CBS 17 first obtained these memos back in October, and they were from county leaders to Sheriff Baker saying he wasn't following proper procedures. In particular, they call attention to promotions, pay raises, and not properly bidding out contracts for services at the jail. The sheriff says he was trying to act quickly to fix issues he discovered after taking office. He also said he's worked with the county manager to address the concerns. He said he wants to be transparent and accountable, but also said he's frustrated because he believes supporters of the previous sheriff, Donnie Harrison, leaked these memos. It's unethical also in the manner in which the document was leaked. So who's going to address that? I'm not hiding anything. I don't have anything to hide. That's all right here. Just a few minutes ago, I heard from a county spokesperson who said the county manager stands by these memos that went out, and they are working with the sheriff to make sure that he is indeed following county guidelines. Coming up new at 6, I asked the sheriff if he's doing anything differently as a result of all of this. Live in Raleigh, Michael Hyland, CBS 17 News.